Hi guys and welcome to today's video. So I'm going to be showing you two different techniques um, for these sort of fairy tale mismatch nails. The, um, I did these a couple of weeks ago before the launch of the fairy tale collection from Magpie Glitter um, and my original nails were inspired by Margarita's nails from Instagram. Um, I'd seen the nails ages ago and knew that the new fairy tale collection would be perfect um, for those so I did them for the launch of the fairy tale collection and then one of my fellow nail tech friends Terry um, also did her own. Now I did mine um, which is the left hand side over sort of um, corresponding gel colours to the glitters so in a sort of patchwork kind of way and I also did it that way for my client as well. Whereas Terry, who kindly told me how she did hers, did hers over a silver base. She did also add in a bit of tiara, um, which is a magpie dust. But um, I haven't done that in the tutorial for you guys today. I've, I've sort of simplified it a bit for you. So we've got the left hand side, which is sort of a patchwork type of thing and um, is a bit of a bolder look and then we've got the right hand side which is just over a silver base. So I'm just going to show you how to do both of these techniques, you can decide which one you want to do. So if you want to find out how to create both of these techniques using the Fairy Tale Collection by Magpie Beauty then just stay tuned. So for this tutorial you're going to need four separate colours. So I'm using OPI gel colour and I've got That's Hilarious, Mod About You, Gelato on my mind and purple Palooza pants. So, and these are all pastel colours. So obviously, we've got a mint green, um, a pastel pink, pastel blue, and a pastel lilac. So, any sort of colours that you've got that those type of shades would work fine. So, and then these are the four glitters that I'm going to be using today. So, they're by Magpie Beauty, and they're four out of the five fairy tale collection. So, we've got Ella, Fiona. Alice and Anna. Then to apply the glitters I've got the Magpie applicator brush which is the smaller sort of detailer brush and then obviously you've got the duster brush. Then as well I've got a nail art brush this is the Lucente D2 and also got a ring thing palette as well. So I'm just going to be showing you obviously on a nail pot today. So get your pastel pink colour and we're just going to do one thin coat of the pastel pink colour and cure that in our lamp. Okay so I've just decanted each of the four colours into my ring thing and got my nail up brush so I'm just picking up whichever colour you want to first and we're just going to randomly paint on the colours. By adding all the colours um, all at once uncured onto the nail means that they kind of all mesh together a little bit, not too much but just a little bit. So we're now going to pop this in our lamp for 30 seconds. So then we're just going to get our glitters and we're just going to pour each of them out into the lids. our nail pop and our detailer brush and we're just going to pile on that glitter to the corresponding matching colour and obviously it doesn't matter if it goes over the lines. Just like that. So then I'm just going to Burnish these all in get my duster brush and just 
dust all of the excess off and then we're going to top coat that twice wipe off the inhibition layer and then that one is all done so and then for the other tutorial which is a lot simpler um, we're going to be using a silver base so this is OPI gel colour turn on the hot light so we're just going to start off by doing um, two really thin coats of the silver curing in between each layer so and again I've just got the four colours all in the glitter pot lids and we're going to get our detailer brush again and do basically the same, we're just going to add on the glitter colour wherever we want. I'll do it in the same sort of place that I did the other one so you can kind of see the difference when they're next to each other. Like that and... Then again, we're just going to burnish those colours in, like that. Get our duster brush again and just brush off any excess. So, and that one is all done. So, I'm going to top coat this twice, curing in between each layer. I'll wipe off the inhibition layer and then I'll be back with you. So, and here are the finished results. So, there's not much between them. But there is a little bit. I think um, with it over the silver base, um, it's a bit more subtle. Um, but I do think it meshes well together over the silver base. But there's not much in it. You know, the colours all look the same. It's just whether you want a more bolder look or a more subtle look. Um, but I love both of them. I I really liked what Terry did with her nails. I thought they were beautiful. Um, and, you know, you would have seen that at the beginning of the video as well. So I hope that you like these two mini tutorials. Um, Please like and subscribe for future videos. And I'll see you all again soon. Bye.